Hey everyone, my name is Sharon Thompson and I am the premier leader of my team of Posh Bells. And today I want to talk about sampling, but not just any sampling. So it's officially fall, my favorite season. People are buying their fall decor, people are buying their awesome costumes for their kids for Halloween, which is also my favorite holiday. So you can buy Posh and Halloween and sampling and I'm obviously there. So we all know that we want to make our samples look pretty and professional and just basically really appealing to our customers or our potential customers. We want to get them intrigued so they want to go home and immediately use these samples because of how cute the packaging is or whatever. So I'm going to share with you guys a few ideas that I came up with. Um, a lot of these are really simple, they're really quick, but most importantly they're all very inexpensive. Everything that I use here was under $5 at Dollar Tree, obviously minus the sample product, but I'm going to show you. So first things first, this is the cutest spider that I have ever seen, but this is made out of pipe cleaners, and as you can see, I just have a sucker, and then I tape the sample on there, and yes, the sample has my information. You want to make sure that you are providing everyone with your information, with your name, your website, and then a way to contact you, whether it's your phone number, your email, or both. You want to make sure that once they get the sample, they're going to know how to get in contact with you if they have any questions or anything else. Next up, we have another treat holder. This is a little pumpkin guy that I made with cardstock. And I just printed off the pumpkin, glued it on there. You open it up, and there's the sample and the sucker. And then on the back, of course, I have taped my business card for them. So there's that. And then next up is a cool little treat bag. Yes, I do love candy corn. So I have candy corn in the bottom, and then in the middle I have portal samples and my business card. And this is perfect for those moms. you got to pamper them for Halloween. You have to. And then here I wanted to do a mini facial. So I printed this guy off of the internet. It says, skin filling dried out, do you need pampering? I wrote down the steps to each one, and then at the bottom I have my business card. And going off of that one, this is the cutest witch I've ever seen, also. And I found this printable online, and you open up her cape, there are the summarized steps for a mini facial, and then right here is my business card. So I really do love these. And these are perfect if you have kids that want to help you in your business. Those are perfect to do together. And then last but not least, we all know that Frankenstein needed some pampering. So right here we have Frankenstein. And obviously this needs to be taped down, but you open it up and right there is some samples and some business cards. And then right there is Frank. So also I would like to mention that Spooky Posh, even though it is sold out, you can still sample out your Spooky Posh to your customers or potential customers. It's still posh, it's still quality ingredients, and it's still affordable products. So you're still getting out the message about Posh, even through retired products. So keep that in mind. So make it inexpensive. You don't have to be Martha Stewart. Um, stay within your budget. Don't go over the top. And stay within the time that you have to devote to making your samples pretty. But just make them eye candy and make them perfect for your customers that they're going to want to get them on their body as fast as possible. Thank you guys so much, and I'll see you later. Bye.